Hi all! In this video we are going to be finding coterminal angles in degrees. If you take a look at x and y axis, all of the angle measures begin here. It's a 0 degrees or 0 pi, that is your starting point on the x-axis, the positive side of the x-axis is your starting point. Point. Your positive angle measures will be going counterclockwise. If you notice, x and y axes are split into four sections and they are intersecting at a right angle of 90 degrees. So here on the positive y axis, you will have 90 degrees. And every 90 degrees you will have a new benchmark. So plus 90 degrees we will have 180 degrees for a straight line or a straight angle. Plus, plus another 90 degrees you will have 270. Plus another 90 degrees you will have 360 degrees. And the thing about angles, they can keep on going. We can have another 90 degree rotation and we will have 450 degrees here. We can add another 90 degrees and you will have 540 degrees here. And you can add another 90 degrees, you will get 630 degrees here and another 90 degrees you will have 720 degrees here. Now let's say you have a 45 degrees angle. If you do one rotation of 360 degrees you will come back to the same angle. So 45 degree angle is coterminal with 405 degree angle. If you do another rotation of 360 degrees, which is a circle, and you will have 765 degrees, which is coterminal with 405 and 45 degree angles. If you think about time and you have your clock, let's say 2 o'clock, every 12 hours, which is one rotation of 360 degrees, our hand will hit 2 o'clock. It could be 2 p.m., 2 a.m. Those angles are coterminal. You can also have negative angles and they go clockwise. If you go towards negative y-axis, you will have negative 90 degrees, then you will have negative 180 degrees here, you will have negative 270 degrees, and coming back to zero with negative 360 degrees. and. Just like before, you can keep going, you can keep on subtracting 90 degrees. So let's work on some examples. Here we have to find a positive angle less than 360 degrees that is coterminal with negative 115 degrees. The goal of the game is to have an angle that is between 0 and 360 degrees. Since we are starting with negative angles and I know that every 360 degrees in positive or negative direction angles will repeat so I can add or subtract a circle which is 360 degrees in order to get to my answer. Since I'm starting with a very small value, much smaller than zero, I will add a circle, so plus 360 degrees, and get 245 degrees, 
Since 245 degrees lies between 0 and 360, this is my answer. Here we have to find the positive angle less than 360 degrees that is coterminal with 823 degrees. Now, 823 degrees is much more than 360 degrees. And the goal of the game is to have an angle that falls between 0 and 360 degrees. I'm going to take away 360 degrees until I have my value. So 823 degrees minus 360 degrees. I get 463 degrees. And this is still more than... 360 degrees. So I am going to take away 360 degrees again and I get 103 degrees. Since 103 degrees is positive and is less than 360 degrees, I'm done. This is my answer. There is a faster way of doing this problem. So let's do 8 to 3 degrees. If you notice that 823 degrees is more than twice the value of 360 degrees. You could take away from 823 two times 360 degrees. So you would have 823 degrees minus 720 degrees. And your result would be 103 degrees. And this would be the same answer. That's all.